love, like. Today I will share example sentences for love and like. Let's begin another happy little grammar lesson. Present tenses. I love my kids. I like my kids. Present tenses. He loves his kids. He likes his kids. We love our kids. They like their kids. Present perfect. I have loved spending time with you. He has loved spending time with me. I have liked spending time with you. He has liked spending time with me. Using love can sound more natural than like, but sometimes the word enjoy is a much better choice than like or love in many situations. Past tense. I loved the video by O Tacos for Otakus. I liked the video by O Tacos for Otakus. He loved to dance. He liked to dance. They loved to dance. They liked to dance. Difference in usage in adverb form. She looked lovely in cosplay. I am likely to try limited edition snacks. You could not switch lovely for likely in the previous sentences. The reason is lovely is about beauty, but likely is about whether or not something will happen. Both should not be used when offering something. Would you like to have some tea? Yes, I would like some tea, please. Yes, I would love some tea, please. Both sound native as a response when offered something. And thank you for visiting. Please like, subscribe, and comment. Feel free to ask any questions or suggest future topics in the comments. If you like Christian poetry, check out my other channel, Narrow Gate vs. Scandal Gate on YouTube and many other streaming platforms. If you find my Christian poetry book, excuse me, you can find my Christian poetry book at amazon.com under First Fruits by LDG DJ. My website is otakos for otakus.com. Have an incredible day. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that who, uh, whoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. For God did not send his Son into the world to condemn the world, but, he, but that the world through him might be saved. He who believes in him is not condemned, but he who does not believe is condemned already, because he has not believed in the name of the only begotten Son of God.